today in the management system working group. We started the session talking about the change that is coming to all of the management system standards in regard to um, climate change. It is being treated as a auto revision. So we talked about what it means, what it means to us as IAF members, what it means to organized um, or certified organizations. And we had a presentation by the Joint Technical Coordination Group of ISO, and then we had a discussion paper related to transition, I'll say, and communications necessary so that we're all consistent and on the same page as those changes are rolled out. Yeah, and then, then we went on to uh, address three discussions papers. Uh, one of them was related to medical device. So we looked at a portion of that. The, the, it is going to be further discussed at the medical device uh, working group. Uh, the discussion papers, as, you'll, as usual, are, do generate a lot of discussions, which is great. And it basically helps clarify some of the issues that are being brought forward. Then we had a really lengthy discussion and really good discussion on, on the search search and the new mandatory document that just came out. Uh, these questions are going back to the DMC. Uh, to get some further clarification or uh, dealing with these uh, different challenges that, that the, some of the members have brought up forward. But overall, I think it was really good discussion over the, the whole search search. Then we had um, Jeff Hunt, who is the new ISO TC176 chair. He came, um, he's replacing Nigel Croft. He came as the liaison to IAF representing um, the TC176 and talked about ISO 9001 brand integrity. Um, what we could be doing together to improve on the integrity of accredited certifications and the standard itself. So we talked about expected outcomes, revising the expected outcome document, I believe that's already in the works, as well as some APG papers and um, gathering more data to better understand um, certifications in the marketplace and the integrity of those certifications. So I think we had a good discussion and, and welcomed Jeff as the, the liaison from TC176. We also went through all of the documents that have been revised since the last Management System Working Group meeting. There was a lot that went through what we called administrative change, um, references, um, terminology, so nothing um, earth shattering there. And then we quickly went through coming soon. Um, we heard MD16 will be coming soon. MD28 to support cert search um, was just um, published last week. So we also talked about that MD. And then forward thinking topics, we talked a bit about the APG um, related to um, APG EMS is meeting tonight. The APG QMS is not meeting because the chair is not here, but we need to be getting back to some of those APG documents, hoping that they're across management systems and not specific to each management system unless it's, it's really necessary. So we're looking for some revisions to those documents, I think, that are already published and then hopefully some new documents going forward. Yeah, and there was uh, one particular topic also in the forward thinking that was brought forward that was not originally on the agenda, was how can we deal with uh, how the ABs can uh, basically get more assessors involved in, in the industry. Uh, so that will be actually put forward back to the uh, 17 or 11 working group to see if they can address that issue. Yes. And then we also talked about an up and coming management system standard, which is the 42001, ISO 42001, related to artificial intelligence management systems. That's going to be discussed further um, this afternoon in the digital working group. So hopefully we'll have some crossover of members in that group as well to further discuss 42001 and 42006, which is the requirements for auditing and certifying to 42001. So that was also a good discussion, but certainly more to come um, this afternoon in the digital working group. Yeah. And then other th another topic was we briefly went over if there's any status updates on the different working groups and task force that are meeting during the, the course of the week. Uh, so everyone just gave a, a really brief summary of what they may be discussing or what's coming up. 
And then I think last but not least, we finally created an online forum for our work group. So we started using that, I don't know, a month or so ago. So we just reminded folks to make sure they, they're they part of that forum and that they, they watch for upcoming forum items. Some will be informal that we'll be looking for input and then others will be more formal um, forum items for them to consider and, and provide their, their input and their feedback on. And that was it. Yeah, that was it. I, I think overall we had a very good meeting. I mean, we even went 30 minutes over, so I guess it's a testament of the discussions that we've had. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and we had, what, 100 and some people registered, and I don't know, maybe we had 75 or so yeah. in the room, so it was a good turnout. Yeah.